Hello. Um, I am Tucker Gilbert. Reese Gessner. Sawyer Miller. And today we are going to be talking about the Super Bowl and our top three games of the 2022-2023 season. So, my thoughts on the Super Bowl, it, it was a pretty good game. I just thought there were a couple of calls I didn't quite understand that were just like, why, you know? Yeah. Like, that holding call at the end, at that point you just let him play. And yeah, but just, I heard that he like admitted to holding him, but yeah. he just didn't want to, he just wanted him to let it slide because it was at the end. But um, I thought that the Super Bowl was pretty, was pretty good. Well, what was the end score? 37, 34? I'm pretty sure it was. No, I thought it was, no, it was 38, 38, 35. Oh, yeah, yeah, 35. Yeah, it was tied in the field goal. Um, yeah, but a bunch of people thought that, like, the Super Bowl was, like, scripted, like, rigged. I, I kind of feel like it would have Yeah, been. it was. Yeah. But I'm, like, the most of the deals, like, people's predictions was the Eagles to win, which I thought was... I honestly was I wasn't rooting for them, but I thought they were because they did have a pretty big lead in the first half. Like, what was it, twenty-four to seven or six? Six in the first quarter or half. Then uh, Pat Mahomes just came back and won it for him. Yeah. What are your what thoughts? Reese? Yeah. It was rigged. Or the Chiefs just really like the. Whatever person. Mm -hmm. No. The refs? The halftime show. Oh. Yeah, I think they kind of got motivated by that. It like, would have been you know better if one of the people just flew off, just jumped off, and just started flying away. Yeah. I think that too. That that's been pretty epic. Yeah. You know what I mean? That I, mean, I saw a video where this one, uh, this one guy almost fell off. He was like doing like a back stand and all, so. But yeah, yeah, I thought it was kind of dumb. Now we're gonna talk about our top three NFL games. We're gonna start from three and then back to two and then our very best game we thought of the season. And so, at number three, I have the um, the Vikings and the Bills game. Justin Jefferson and Stephon Diggs both had a pretty good game. And it was just back and forth between them two. What about you, Tucker? Um, uh, I'm probably gonna go with the Vikings and Colts. You know, they came back from a 30-point deficit, and I think uh, Justin Jefferson really showed his route running skills in that game against Stephon Gilmore. So, do you think? You, um, do you see that one hit uh, Gilmore got on Justin Jefferson? Yeah. I kind of thought that they should have threw him out for that because it was helmet to helmet, but yeah. Um, I guess the rest didn't think that. What about you, Reese? You think the who do you think had the best game? Well, Pretty good you know, game. Probably the Colts and Vikings. Yeah. At my number two, I have the Colts and Vikings because obviously they slay the day on that day. And yeah, best comeback ever in, in the history of the NFL, and you can't beat that. Um, my number two, I'm gonna have to go with the Bills and Vikings because there at the beginning, the Vikings scored, and then it were Bills scored, Vikings scored, and then after that, the Bills just scored 17 straight points. And so they were up by this amount, and then the uh, Vikings started to come back and win in overtime with a game winning field goal. What so. about you, Reese? What's your number two spot? I don't know. I wasn't really watching a lot of football. Yeah, you don't follow a lot of football? Never now and then. I just follow it all the time. I see. Alright, in my number one, I have the best playoff comeback ever with the Chargers and the Jaguars. Trevor Lawrence played a really good game and 
got the best comeback ever in the playoffs. Like, that is crazy. The Jaguars beat the Chargers after being down like 28. Mm -hmm. That's crazy. And I'm pretty sure he had three interceptions. In four. The, four interceptions in the first half. And then just completely turned it around after halftime. More in the game. Yeah. Um. I'm gonna have to go with the um, probably the 49ers and the Cowboys. I thought it was a pretty good game, and Brock Purdy had one of his best games, I think. And for only being in the starter for a couple like six or so so weeks, he was. Almost, he was better than their starting quarterback. So, and I just kind of thought it was funny that last play the Cowboys ran. It was, I don't know what they were thinking, but yeah, yeah. What about you, Reese? Who who do you have as the best game in this season? Super Bowl. <laughs> yeah, I mean the regular season. True. Uh, or the playoffs, like not. I don't know. I don't know. Probably one of the Colts games. I see. <laughs> like when they lose or when they win? When they win. Oh, so like never. I mean, <clears throat> <laughs> I mean they are 4-13-1 or something like that. Yeah. My cousins and my uncle like the Colts. Yeah. It's kind of weird how they suck and they still like them. But, um, yeah. Yeah. Um. I think that's all for this week, uh, and that's all, folks. Bye-bye.